must have heard the word mean machine being used and misused quite liberally in the auto industry. But really, Harley's new fat bob takes being mean to a whole new level. At no angle is it trying to smile at you or trying to make a fashion statement. All it's telling you is to shut up and ride it. You talk about attitude. Yes, it is the big, bold street brawler from Harley's Dyna family, ready to bring the fight to the Indian market. But don't get its name mixed up with Harley's Fat Boy or the Street Bob, already available in India. Although the Fat Bob looks to combine the best of both. So why is it called the Fat Bob? Fat comes from the white stands of its forks and massive tires, and the Bob from the Bob fenders. So let's take a peek inside that belly. The Fat Bob rides a powerful 1,585cc twin cam engine, producing an equally strong 126 newton meters in torque. Harley doesn't share the power figures of its bikes, but it's safe to say there is more than enough to get the 325 kilo Fat Bob up and away. Also, the electronic sequential port fuel injection gives Fat Bob the much needed refinement amidst all that aggression. Now the riding stance on the Fat Bob is also equally aggressive with both your arms stretched out onto these drag style handlebars. But what really is uncomfortable are these forward mounted foot controls which not only takes some time to get used to them but also takes a toll on your legs especially on those long journeys. But the rider's seat itself is well padded and helps you transfer your weight especially because it's a low seating on those sharp curves. But it's really the open highway that is Fat Bob's best friend and really makes it feel at home. But Fat Bob does not hide his weight, especially while taking those narrow bends or trying to park it. Because that's when you really have to put all your muscle into it. Also on low gears in start-stop city traffic, the heat from the engine does get uncomfortable for the rider, but cools off in higher gears on the highway. But what really is comfortable is the way the Fat Bob handles both on the highway and even the hilly terrain. The six-speed cruise drive transmission is smooth and precise, and that made my life a little easier. The Fat Bob was surprisingly quick off the blocks despite its weight, and finally settled down nicely between 100 and 120 km per hour on the highway. The suspension, especially the twin rear shock absorbers, smoothened the ride for the most part including the big potholes and the tall speed breakers. The brakes with the ABS are decent but could be better and more precise to give you more confidence, especially at high speeds. They say if looks could kill and the Fat Bob almost does that with the kind of aggressive attitude in its styling and really scares me to use words like beautiful, nice and pretty on this incredible Hulk. And it's from the front really that the true character of the bike really comes through starting off with the beefy 130 millimeter tires on the 16 inch wheel and if that doesn't blow your mind away just look up you'll see these dual chrome headlamps twin pods sitting next to each other making it doubly aggressive as well as makes every other bike on the road almost bow down in respect and as you move up these headlamps you see these drag style handlebars add so much more appeal to the bike and make the bike look like one of those bouncers standing in front of the bar with folded arms um, as you look down those um, handlebars, you see the beautiful handcrafted fuel tank blending well into the bold character of the bike. And as you look down, you see these fantastic Tommy Gun exhaust 212 exhaust adding that beautiful, elongated, beautiful, bold element to the bike itself. Really, Fat Bob is not someone you want to mess around with. The Fat Bob has some neat instrumentation with the speedometer and a small digital display for the odometer and dual trip meters, all well located on the gas tank top. Besides the candy orange that we rode, Fat Bob will be available in two shades of black, matte black and black denim. So does Fat Bob command a fat price too? Priced at 12.8 lakh rupees, ex-showroom Delhi, the Fat Bob will be the priciest bike from the Dyna family and the 14th model in Harley's India lineup. And like some of Harley's other models, it will be assembled in India. 
so it could well be a fat chance that Fat Bob throws his weight around on Indian roads. India's number one news app just got even better. Download NDTV's new app. Fully optimized for retina display. Full screen view. Faster response time. And Sudoku. NDTV's new iPad app. Download now.